So without further ado, Nathaniel Anthony Ayers. One in 17 Americans, about 6% of the population overall, um, has diagnoses of serious mental illness. These are, are, are disorders that strike people in the, in, in the prime of life. They affect the people themselves, they affect um, their family members, and it's an issue that all of us are right to be concerned about. Managing symptoms is not viewed as being enough any longer. The real issues are how can people lead meaningful lives. We really want a partnership, but it's hard to really get a partnership when people, by their, uh, when in the common culture which pervades the mental health system, is if you want to say somebody cannot do a job, what do you say? It's like turning the asylum over to the inmates. And so we need to be included into the family of humankind. And really over the past 15 years, the possibilities for people with mental illness have really, it's a remarkable change. But I also know that most people with serious mental illness don't receive anything like that in the country today. And that's where my research is focused, is to try and understand how we can take what we know and take the possibility and make it more real. Our human rights should not end where our psychiatric diagnosis begins. We are not to be the scapegoats of society. We have to get beyond stereotypes just like we have to get them beyond whether it's based on race, ethnicity, sexual orientation, and other types of stereotypes. This devastates people's lives. It devastates because no matter how good your treatment is, you go outside and people won't employ you, they don't want to be around you, then what type of life are you going to have? <laughs>